Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we will guide you through the process of resolving issues with the Aclibri app not working. Without further delay, let's dive into the solution. First solution to fix this problem is a force close and restart Aclibri app. For that, go to your phone setting, open app manager or apps, then select the uh, Aclibri app from the app list. Then I click on for stop from the bottom right corner. Confirm by clicking OK and then reopen the Huckleberry app. Second solution to fix this problem is a disable and enable your internet connection. To resolve this problem, try toggling your internet connection. If you are using mobile data, then turn it off for 5 to 10 seconds, then switch it back on. For Wi Fi users, turn off Wi Fi for the same duration and then I turn it back on. Alternatively, activate aeroplane mode for 4 to 5 seconds, then disable aeroplane mode. After that, check if the issue resolves. Third solution to fix this problem is a clear Huckleberry app catches. Clearing the app catches can often resolve performance issues. To clear Huckleberry app catches, go to your phone setting, open app manager, and then select the app once more. Then I click on storage and catches and then tap on clear catches to clear the app catches. Fourth solution to fix this problem is update Huckleberry app to the latest version. To do this, head to the Play Store and search for Huckleberry app. After that, select the app. If an update is available, you will see an update button next to the app. Tap on it to update the app to the latest version. Once updated, launch the app again. Fifth solution to fix this problem is uninstall and reinstall the Huckleberry app. For that time, go to Play Store again, then search for the app and then select uninstall. Once uninstalled, reinstall the app by clicking on the install button. If none of the above methods work, the issue may be Huckleberry app server is down. In such cases, you may need to wait for some time and try again later. Thank you for watching our video and we hope these solutions help resolve the Eclipse app issue for you.